What's going on guys? Great Disciple back with another gameplay. Uh, in the background, it's a nuclear on Nuketown. Need I say any more? It's great gameplay. It's fast paced. Uh, nuclear starts I think about a minute, minute and a half into the game. So enjoy it. Back on my 1500 subscriber um, video, I got a question from Truth Chaos. Tell me a funny story. Alright, here you go. I think it's funny. <laughs> but, okay, so I think I was around 13 years old and I had a buddy staying the night. His name is Kenneth. And, uh... He's actually a lieutenant in the Air Force now. I, I don't speak with him anymore. We kind of lost touch. But so he stayed the night at my house, and you know my parents are asleep. I think my brothers, uh, um, they they were staying away. My sister was asleep. We weren't tired, all right. <laughs> and so we went down to my garage. I don't know why we went into the garage. We had a two-story house. We went to the garage, and we found a roll of duct tape brand new roll of duct tape. I think we had two actually. Maybe one was just about out <laughs> and then we found another one and we, we looked at each other like what can we do with this? So we thought about it for a little bit and we're like let's go out. So we snuck out the window <laughs> and we started walking around the neighborhood. You know I live in a it was a suburban neighborhood so a lot of houses and uh, we're walking up and down the streets we're looking around like what can we do what can we do? We see a boat like okay all right so <laughs> some some poor schmuck had parked his boat out in his driveway and so we went over to it with the duct tape and we just go ahead and we wrap the entire motor with duct tape the propeller and everything and but we still had a lot of duct tape left over so we're like okay all right let's keep going walking a couple streets over and we see a car did look like every other car we had just passed but for some reason he said stand on this side I'll stand on that side and we will wrap this car in duct tape so over and under we would hand each other the duct tape and wrap this car there goes one roll of duct tape we still had more so we continued to walk <laughs> I don't even know what we were thinking I think it's probably like one o'clock in the morning we continued to walk to our junior high school and we get there and most of the lights in the junior high school are off we see a couple of them are still on and there was this intersection with a, with four stop signs right and we still had this whole roll of duct tape and uh, we, we kind of looked at each other I think we both kind of had the same idea it wasn't really any traffic anybody doing anything and uh, well, what we did was we went from stop sign to stop sign on one side and we wrapped duct tape directly across the street Okay, we're <laughs> kind of created like a barrier, but it was really hard to see, right? And um, then we went to go hide in the bushes, and we laughed so hard that night because we would watch as these cars would pull up to the stop sign, and they would see this duct tape, and they would pause, and then they would back up and they would go back the way that they came, <laughs> all right? So we had this janitor who was, uh, I think he was special needs at our school. His name was Giannis. And um, the kids would all give him a hard time. And he would ride his 10 speed to and from school to clean the school. We didn't realize that Giannis on a Saturday was cleaning the school. And he comes out of his <laughs> out of the school on his bike just barreling towards this street, all right? He hits that duct tape and he does a backflip and oh my gosh, I don't think to this day I have laughed that hard in my life. Now granted, it was awful what we did, alright? We had no intention of hurting this guy and he wasn't hurt. He just got up cursing, got back on his bike and kept going. So confused as to what, <laughs> as to, as to what happened. I swear to this day I've never laughed so hard. So the next day, Sunday morning, we're getting up ready to go for church. My parents are driving through the neighborhood. We see the guy outside yelling, taking this duct tape off of his motor to his boat. And then two streets over, some lady out there with like a scrubber and a putty knife trying to get the duct tape off her car that we had wrapped. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I hope you guys liked it. Leave, leave a thumbs up button, put a comment down below. Do not do what we did and have an awesome day. Talk to y'all soon.